International shipping contributes to around 3% of greenhouse gas emissions worldwide. The International Maritime Organization has therefore set out a strategy for phasing these out to align with the Paris Agreement temperature goals. Making ships more efficient means they burn less fuel with fewer emissions. It is also possible to replace the fossil fuels currently used with fuel made from renewable energy such as hydrogen or liquid biogas. And it is possible to use the natural environment at sea to provide energy for moving ships, such as directly harnessing wind and solar power. Czech uses digital modeling to generate two highly environmentally efficient vessel designs, a cruise vessel and a bulk carrier. The digital, future-proof vessel design platform enables the vessel design and technologies to be developed in symbiosis over the lifetime of the vessels. The aim is to reduce greenhouse gas emissions by 99% and to reduce the energy demand by 50%. Finally, these digital models will be demonstrated on two real vessels sailing the seas. The cruise vessel uses an advanced hydrogen engine in combination with a waste heat recovery system to cover the engine needs on board the ship with maximum efficiency. Excess heat from the jacket water of the engine is converted into electricity using an organic Rankine cycle. The system is designed to be compatible with fuel cells with over-the-air control software updates allowing it to adapt to evolving regulations. On both vessels, the energy needs for propelling the ship through the water are reduced by keeping the hull clean using an ultrasound anti fouling system. This ensures that the hull operates at its lowest resistance through the water and also avoids the use of harmful substances and the spread of invasive marine species when traveling between regions of the globe. Environmental and economic considerations will be taken into account in developing itinerary optimization software. The bulk carrier uses aerodynamically optimized wing sails to capture the forces in the wind in propelling the ship forward using renewable energy in the most direct way possible. The resistance of the vessel traveling through the water is reduced by deploying a carpet of microbubbles beneath the hull. This reduces friction, lowering the vessel's fuel consumption and emissions. A gate rudder is used to provide accurate maneuvering with maximal efficiency. The vessels are further optimized using automated vessel routing and weather predictions to minimize energy use and work in synergy with the engine and wind propulsion systems. The vessels use scalable hybrid electric power plants, allowing engines, waste heat recovery system, batteries, wind, solar power and fuel cells to be seamlessly integrated in the production of power to make the best use of the available energy. Finally, the emission reduction outcomes of the Czech project will be extrapolated to the world's fleet, allowing total potential savings in greenhouse gas emission reductions to be calculated. Framework conditions such as legislation, business model, and infrastructure that facilitate greenhouse gas reduction are identified. The Czech Communication Dissemination and Exploitation Strategy will help ensure these outcomes are fully understood by the industry, providing the confidence to replicate those advances across the world's fleet.